Hey, can a concert hall? 75% of the audience were female. So again, the percentage, I will change it to fraction. In terms of simplest form, it will be 3 out of 4. With the audience being 4U, female being 3U. And of course, if it's not female, then it has to be the male. So the male It will be one unit. So with this, I will start off the ratio. Alright, since I get the units, I can put it down in ratio. Okay. Female to male. Three to one. Now we look at the next part. 75 females and 5 male left the concert halfway. So left means it's a decrease. Okay, so a minus 75 for the female and a minus 5 for the male. Okay, and to differentiate again, I'll put in the U. So that we will not mix up. Okay, thinking that it's units or whatsoever for the ratio here. Okay, the next one is the interesting one. The remaining audience were allocated seats in groups of 10. Okay, so there's always 10 in one group, 10 in one group. Okay, so in other words, the total in this one group is a 10. Then they said that each group has three males. So this 10, right, take note, is our so-called one set here. There will always be three male. So if there's three male, in terms of the female, seven. So you know that for every one group, seven female, three male, and it will always occur in this, right? So in other words, they are actually giving you the ratio. Just that they do not give it to you so straightforward. But you need to understand that you can get ratio from here. Okay? So the female to male, 7 to 3. And I'll put in P to differentiate the difference in the unit size. Okay. Now, you can see, right, when the number that change is different, it will fall under this everything change. And therefore, the way that we do, we will make our after ratio here to be the same. Okay. And in order not to mix up what I'm doing, I will put an assumption here to remind ourselves that this is not the actual figure that we should be using. Okay? So the female to male, female is 7, to make it to be the same as the 3, we multiply each other. So the female side, you got to multiply by 3. And this multiplication of 3 is for the whole vertical, okay, the column here. So 3 times 3, 9. The negative 75 times 3, you get a negative 225. And 7p times 3, 21p. Okay, so we did up this side for the female. For the male, 3 plus times 7 to make it the same. So 1u times 7, 7u. Negative 5 times 7, negative 35. And lastly, of course, 3p times 7, you get 21p. Okay? So it's the same as the previous two questions that we have done. Okay? 9u minus 225, you are left with the 21p. Over this side, 7u minus 35, you are left with the 21p. So basically, this 9u minus 225 is the same as 7u minus 
35. Alright, so we'll write this down. We are at this step. Okay? Always remember, make all the units to one side, all the numbers to one side. The greater number of unit will be the one that will so-called remain. Okay? So 9 and 7, the greater one is 9. So 9 will stay here. And with that, we have to shift the 7U over. The 7U here is what we call a positive 7. So when you shift over to the other side, you need to make it negative, a minus. Okay. And since our left side here is all going to be the units, our right side will have to be the numbers. A negative 225 here, when you shift over, become a positive. Okay. And we can don't put the positive sign for the first number. This minus 35 and negative 35 will just stay on this side, so we put it down. Okay? And now we will get 2u to be 190. With 2u being 190, one unit will be a 95. The question asks for the people in the audience at first. Total audience at first, remember it's the for you. So we can look for for you. 95 times 4, final answer, 380.